there was a sale, so I purchased the Tenba GoPro bag. This is the Shootout 14L. Fits four GoPro cameras. This is was released uh, a while ago, but I just bought it because it was on sale. It's got a thin, long profile, which I like. It's, it's not wide and bulky, but it's still pretty thick. You got some pads on one side, pad on the other side, a bunch of straps to put in your gorilla pods or tripods on both sides or, or a big water bottle. The front panel, two straps here. What is this? You get extra Velcro straps that this holds tripods. Lock them in. Then you have a mini compartment here. You get a weather wrap put over the bag. I wish this was just all water resistant instead of having these, but nothing else. It's a pretty deep pocket. You could fit a good uh, iPad 10 inch in there if you wanted to. Get smaller pockets in here. Then you have another pocket compartment. What is this? This is a little, oh, headphone. Wanna stick some headphones in there? This one goes all the way down. This might be meant for water bladders. You wanna put a water bladder in there? I can imagine somebody wanting to do that. You got some straps in there to hold, to, to secure something. Don't know what it is yet. Whatever you wanna put in there. Then there's a top pouch, which appears to be for sunglasses. Now, it's got microfiber lining. Protect it. It's got your thick straps. You got a chest chest latch. And then you got one for your waist. They're both adjustable. Got some padding and space in between your back where the sweat can dissipate. Got another Velcro. This bag opens from the back. It doesn't open from the front when you're putting your GoPro gear, which has its pros and cons. Some people don't like that design. And then this part opens. Voila. Here's the main reason why I got this bag. It's for these smaller little pouches here that even though this is designed for a GoPro, I see this more as an audio bag to put all my audio gear with transmitters, wires, so many accessories when you have audio. I thought I could use this for, you know, the GoPro because I do have three GoPros, but when I'm transporting audio gear and I don't use the GoPros, these individual little pouches here by themselves can be pretty expensive. So the fact that I was able to get all of them and I can use them I can cannibalize any other thing I want and use them the way I want. That's why one of the reasons that appealed this bag appealed to me. On this front latch, you get a little card holder, a clear view pouch. Two pouches up here and they give you an SD card wallet and Another SD card wallet with some extra loops here that you can put in wires, or this looks like it could fit AA batteries. And they're both strapped to the bag, so they don't you don't lose them. That's nice. Now these individual modules inside are Velcroed down on the back lining here. Oh, I love the clear view. And you can, the, this also comes with cards. Oh, here they are. This comes with little cards here that you can use their cards or you can write your own on a Sharpie and stick the cards in here to show what, what these, what's in the bag. And I love these little, the, this layout. Just really fits for what, what my needs are. Velcro in, 
You could remove all of these two and have a completely empty inside. In, inside. But yeah, this is why I got this bag because of these pouches. Love this design. Really can fit in a lot of little things, a lot of little accessories. This is what it's for. So I just bought this. Right now I'm very happy with it. I'm gonna take it on a shoot, which is out and I'm on a hiking trail. Perfect for this bag. If I have any problems with it, I'll do a follow-up video to complain. Otherwise, I'm pretty happy with it. Oh, even got some latches on the bottom. Oh, the bottom actually feels waterproof. That's good. All right, so that's the Tenba Shootout 14L.